my working area where I cut my vegetables, wash my vessels, drain them. Once they are drained, I keep them by. And if you notice, all my shelves are open by. I don't have any cockroaches. I don't use any chemicals to disinfect my kitchen. That's why I kept it open early. But regularly, I keep wiping it. And uh, this is my uh, this is my storing of water. Okay. And uh, these are the three big pots uh, I use to store cooking water because we once in five days we get water. Okay. Uh, and I must tell you this. Uh, this is my grandmother's pot, this is my mother-in-law's pot and this is uh, my, uh, my mother's pot. Okay, so three generation pots are here and I love it. I clean it once in eight days, okay, to refill the water and clean it. This is the best part of my kitchen because it reminds me of my ancestors. Keep on high flame. Light the gas. Put a lot of coconut oil. Shallow frying it is, but you have to put. I use coconut oil for my cooking. Now it is half an hour marinated and kept in the fridge. Okay. Let the oil fry, uh, oil get hot. Just keep checking. Don't allow it to stick on the pan. Because when you marinate it well, you know, the chances of sticking to the pan is very, very low. Let it fry. And one spoon I have to turn it. Okay? Another three minutes and then it is done. I reduce the flame now, huh? medium. My dear viewers, uh, the fried uh, fish morso is ready to eat. Yummy! And uh, if you want, you can cook the masala that is remaining and pour over this. That's the other option also. But this is okay. Thank you. Please subscribe to my daughter's channel and I'll be putting many more videos.
okay and you have to eat this fish when it is fresh fried thank you abba pat masala is left here. How many pieces of fish you want to eat?